G'day, I'm Sandy, General Manager of Outdoor Connection. And I'm Carl. The Heron is part of our resort range and has been a very popular two-room tent. And we're going to show you how to set it up so you can enjoy your time away as soon as possible. Here's what you get in the kit. In a tent, fly, grey side poles, black ridge pole, pegs and awning poles. Before you begin, select a dry area and clear the ground of any sharp objects. First, peg out all four corners of the inner, making sure it's square and taut, but not stretched. Then peg out the rest of the points. Next, assemble the fiberglass poles. The grey ones are the side poles, and the black one is the ridge pole. Make sure you press it down firmly for a secure fit. Above the door at each end is a T-piece. Place the ends of the ridge poles into the T-pieces then clip them in like so. Slide the short end of these grey poles through the sleeves and into the T-piece at one end only. Slide the remaining grey poles through the sleeves and insert into the cross piece in the middle and the T-piece at the other end. Then stand up the poles at that end. The bottom of the pole will slide over this pin at the base of the tent. Attach all the tent clips to the upright poles. The inner tent is now up. Let's move on to the fly. Using the webbing corner straps, drag the fly lengthwise over the tent. Once you've pulled the fly on and it's in place, tie the fly to the poles inside the top corners. Attach the Velcro tabs on the inside of the fly to the poles. Now let's peg it out. Make sure all the zips are done up and it's best to start at the back of the tent at the corners. The corners have an adjustable strap Make sure you peg it through this loop, about 15 centimetres from the corner on a 45. Then do the back door. These loops are doubled. Make sure you peg through both loops. Next, do the front corners, making it nice and straight along the side. Then the front doors. and the sides. There will be a gap between the fly and the inner. Don't peg it out too far as you could distort the tent's shape. Peg it straight down. Next, peg out the guy ropes. Guy ropes stabilise the top of the tent from strong winds. We recommend you always use them as wind could pick up at any time. Adjust the tension as required. The front and rear fly doors peg out to make these spacious awnings and the three adjustable poles are included in the kit. If it rains, make sure that you lower the adjustable poles so that rain can run off and not pull. This tensioning strap will keep the awning nice and tight. Don't forget to loosen it when you put the awning back down. Outdoor Connection's unique Ventraflow panels encourage airflow, down low, where you sleep. Now we'll show you how to pack down the tent so it'll fit easily into the bag. Pull out all the pegs, except for the inner corners. This versatile outdoor connection peg puller makes it easy. Remove the ties and Velcro from around the poles before removing the fly. Find the middle of each door, fold the fly in half lengthways, and then fold the ends in to form a big square. Fold it like this to make a long rectangle about 60 centimetres wide. Make sure the bottom of the fly is at one end. Zip up all the doors and windows, but leave the door open about this much and that'll let the air out when you roll it. Remove the pole clips and lower the tent. You'll find it easier if you remove the ridge pole from the T-piece first. Straighten out the inner tent. Now remove the corner pegs. Fold lengthwise in half and half again. Lay the fly on top. Grab a bag of poles and roll it up towards the bottom of the fly. This will push all the air out and give a tighter roll. Rolling it up over the poles makes it easier as well. Tie it up and slide it in the bag. 
You're done. And don't forget to make sure that your tent is clean and completely dry before you pack it away. Have fun camping and we'll see you next time. Check out our instructional videos and all things camping related at And we have a YouTube channel. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up if you like our videos.